Foreign Affairs Ministry denies knowledge of Lumbuya's deportation. Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining us live on Projan Media TV. That brings the latest news and the latest updates in the country and across the world. The Minister of Foreign Affairs, General J.J. Odong, says the discussion are going on between Uganda, Turkey, and Interpol regarding the fate of Ugandan blogger Fred Kajui Lumbuya. Lumbuya, who was arrested two weeks ago in Turkey, is in trouble for, among others, being the source of a rumor that dominated social media in July indicating that President Museven was very ill and was admitted to a hospital in Germany. The following days, he took his allegations to even another level when he announced that Museven had died from the hospital where he had been taken. Speaking a few days later, President Museven said the country has got another challenge of social media which needs to be dealt with urgently. He ordered security agencies to hunt down anybody who is trading rumors that he was dead and for those outside the country, their citizenships be revoked. Appearing before Parliament's Foreign Affairs Committee on Thursday, General J.J. Odongo said that the situation and position regarding his status is a matter of discussions that are ongoing between Uganda, Turkey, and Interpol. However, Nkunyinji Mwada, the Chadondo East MP, who is also the Shadow Minister for Foreign Affairs, questioned whether Lumbia was deported to Uganda or still in Turkey. He noted earlier reports by Okelo Oriom, the State Minister for Foreign Affairs, indicating that Lumbia had been deported. In response, Oriam denied the report, saying that he had never said that Lumbe was deported, and he had done saying that he begged not to be misquoted by his colleagues. The shadow minister at no time did I say or did he say that Lumbe was deported. He said he's supposed to be deported. Those were my, uh, his specific words, and he's very careful with his words, as Oriam said. The minister further denied that he never said that Lumbia would be produced in the court of law in Uganda, but rather at an appropriate time uh, being produced by the relevant officers in the courts of law. Well, it was Oriam who said Lumbia was to be deported. That was this one Saturday morning at, uh, at 3.45 a.m. And that did not take place. And now he has withdrawn, taken back his words, saying that he has never said anything like that. And he's always careful with his words. That's what brought in misunderstanding and anger in Loyang Kunjinji Muada, where he really got so angry and the parliament disrupted, couldn't continue. Well, that is it for now. Thanks for watching Projian Media TV. And we'll keep on updating with more of this. Kindly do one thing. Subscribe and turn on the notification button. All these updates will come to you in time. Once again, thanks for watching Projan Media TV.